This is the composition studio at the Red House and after Benjamin Britten and Peter Pears moved here in 1957 this is largely where he carried out his work of composition typically writing in the mornings and then going for a walk in the afternoon to think over what he'd done and plan the next day's work. There's one picture on the bookcase um, that's Frank Bridge who's a composer in his own right and Benjamin Britten's teacher. They met when Britten was 13. Uh, they were introduced by Audrey Alston, who was Britten's viola teacher and who had been a student of, with Frank Bridge at the Royal College of Music. And for the next 10 years or so, they uh, used to meet regularly for marathon composition lessons at Bridge's houses in, first of all, London and then Sussex. Britten was Bridge's only pupil, and by all accounts, Bridge was a fairly unorthodox teacher. These sessions didn't focus on the uh, technical aspects of orchestration or composition, but more on attitudes and approaches, and in particular upon artistic honesty, on the need to find out what it was that you wanted to say, indeed what you had to say, and then to say it clearly, regardless of whether that was going to be popular or not. <laughs> on a theme of Frank Bridge were written in 1937, um, some ten years or more after Bridge and Britain first met. There are eleven pieces based on a theme from one of Brid Bridge's idylls for string quartet, and each of them focuses on an aspect of Bridge's personality, his energy, his curiosity, his sympathy and so forth. They were premiered in 1937 and two years later Britain went to America and the two men never saw each other again. Uh, Bridge died in 1941 before Britain returned. So it's a milestone in Britain's career. In a sense, it's saying thank you to his teacher with, as he says in the dedication, affection and admiration before he strikes out on his own path. It's a fine piece of music in its own right. And for me, it's particularly central because I married into the Bridge family, uh, Frank Bridge's younger brother, uh, the uh, theatre musician and cellist, was my wife's grandfather. So listen to the variations on, on, on a theme of Frank Bridge and enjoy them in their own right, but also, as you do so, listen out to the sound of members of the Bridge family around the world saying, Our Frank taught Benjamin Britten everything he knew. Mm -hmm. 